Mob of the Dead Remastered may be real. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome here, Beer Coming Skull Attack, and today I'm with another video in three days in a row. You, you gotta give me props. Th three days in a row. <coughs> I'm still dying. But, uh, yeah. We have information, some freaking good information from someone from Triarch, an official uh, guy, and I'm gonna let's, so let's just, you know, dive right in. So this all started with Marcus Sellers, no, not Marcus Sellers, Josh Olin, which is the person who works in Triarch, who I'm talking about. He said, how did this get many so many retweets? I could have told you this two years ago. And it says, and it's a tweet from Marcus Sellers saying, Call of Duty 2018 is Black Ops 4, blah, 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 blah. Go watch my first video about Black Ops 4 and you'll hear about all that. But the one noob on Twitter said, what about that BO1 remastered? That in the works? Josh Olin then responded by saying, I would ser seriously doubt it. You'll see some old maps though, I'm sure. Marcus Sellers then replied by saying this, like zombie ones. Zombie Chronicles 2, Mob of the Dead Remastered, so much that can happen. But I'm pretty sure uh, Zombie Chronicles 2 will be a thing. Because if you don't know... <coughs> <coughs> I'm dying, guys. But, uh... If you don't know, Black... Uh... Zombies Chronicles was the number one most sold uh, DLC, I believe, in 2017. And Activision loves their money. I keep saying it in every video because it's the damn truth. Activision loves to make their money, same with Treyarch, and it would make it would just make sense for them to remaster more maps and the map, basically the rest of the map from Black Ops 2, uh, and the ones from Black Ops 1 that we didn't get, which is uh, 5 and Call of the Dead. And I've never played Call of the Dead; I played 5. And uh, Mob of the Dead remastered. Well, if you don't know, I uploaded a video a long time ago, like four or five months, maybe even six. And it said something about how, because it was around the time we got the storyline, and I was watching Noah J reread it, and he's in the it was when they said something about the transit crew being on ice under Mob of the Dead, and uh, so they would, I had to, every, well, everyone was thinking basically that we're getting him back, we're gonna be having the transit crew come back in some way, probably in Mob of the Dead, and I think we're gonna be tran playing as transit crew for ninety per, not ninety, but. Some of the game, some of the, uh, uh, game of Black Ops 4. And I believe that we might, for some form of DLC, get Mob of the Dead remastered, whether it's in a uh, Zombies Chronicles thing, a Black Ops 3 DLC, which I doubt, to, like, hype up, uh, Black Ops 4. But, um, I think we will be getting it maybe as a pre-order bonus, or Black Ops or uh, Zombie Chronicles 2.0. I just... It, it makes so much sense for them to do that. Like, why wouldn't they remaster Marvel of the Dead? That's what everyone wants. And then a long, a little while ago, uh, David Vonahar put out a tweet showing uh, like a shrine or something of a whole lot of signs that say uh, remaster Marvel of the Dead. It was like, on the someone did it on the news with a like, poster board behind them. Uh, a wrestling game. Someone made a shirt for it. So, it would just make sense, because the community wants Mob of the Dead remastered. Once again, they love their money. Why wouldn't they remaster something that the enti almost the entire community wants? So, it just, you know, it all, all works together. Farrak and Activision make their money. The fan base, everyone who plays Call of Duty is happy if they buy it. And then, boom, win-win. But tell me what you guys think about this in the comment section below. And I, as soon as I find any more uh, news about this I will be telling you guys and yeah that's it for this video if you guys like it and also tell me real quick if you guys want to see the rest of this gameplay because I recorded for 20 minutes and uh